Okay. Hi, I am Maria from theteacherschool.com. I am a K-12 educational therapist, and what that means is I provide intensive educational intervention to students who are really struggling with math. One challenge many of my students have is with memorization, especially rote memorization. And this can definitely become a huge block in third and fourth grade when we get to timed multiplication fact tests. Students who struggle to memorize end up being frustrated with math and disliking math because of these tests, even though the ability to memorize is completely separate from math ability and math potential. In fact, the research shows that rote memorization isn't nearly as important as fact fluency. When we focus on memorization alone, st students either know the fact or they blindly guess. And with fact fluency, students learn how to work with numbers in different ways, and they use strategies to find unknown facts. So they're never stuck wondering or guessing. They have ways to find what they don't know. A couple examples of fact fluency might be using seven times two to find seven times four. So doubling uh, seven times two because two groups of seven and two groups of seven make four groups of seven. Another example might be taking 8 times 10 and subtracting a group of 8 to get 8 times 9. Teaching facts with a focus on fluency means that if you, if you ask students to try to figure out the answer for themselves, they usually can. You can learn a few of my favorite number sense building activities by downloading the five free mini lesson plans using the link below. I walk you through five days of number talks, activities, games, and assessments that you can use with your classroom right away. And don't forget to check out the other videos in this series. Thanks and have a good one.